Hi everybody, Douglas Weed here again, and this time we are going to be opening up another one of the facade games. This is Tortuga 1667. Again, it has that nice book look. Um, unlike the other couple of copies, this one has this really nicer um, beige look of an older book, which I think is kind of nice. So we're going to get right into it. Has that strong packaging just like last time. So these book these uh, book games are very well protected. So like I said, this is Tortuga 1667. This is book two in their uh, Dark City game series. In this particular game, uh, the year is 1667, and you are a pilot. I'm sorry, pirate sailing the waters of the Caribbean. Ooh, nice uh, killer octopus uh, art cover on that, which I think is kind of neat. A Spanish galleon floats nearby, and you've uh, talked to your crewmates into working together to steal all of its treasure. What you haven't told your fellow pirates is that you have no intention to share the treasure once you have it. So this is one of those strategy social deduction games with all the rest of their products. Again, it has the 2-9 to nine players, 20 to 40 minutes, age 13 and up. Again, very nice book. All of their books are very uh, uh, well done, quality paper. Uh, getting marooned, rowboats, uh, certain event cards that can come up, treasure maps. The history of Tortuga about some noteworthy pirates, including Henry Morgan, and uh, let's see who else is in here. Uh, yeah, mainly uh, Henry Morgan. And then some optional advanced rules, which I think is kind of neat. So we've got the book here. Let's see what else we've got in here. We've got another one of their uh, maps, which this looks like, again, uh, going to be the uh, mouse pad material, just like Bristol, which it is. So it's a nice quality uh, map. Again, the uh, mouse pad material, so it should uh, hold up really well. And again, it's cleanable, so it's not too hard to uh, keep clean. So let's put this back. Again, another little burlap bag. Again, different color. And let's see what else we have. We have a couple of different types of pieces. So we've got the figurine pieces. And these figurine pieces, uh, they're again, look like they're wood. So they've got some nice quality pieces to them. And a little explosion tile. Again, this is made out of wood, so I think those are very well done. Then we got some little gold treasure chests here. Let's see what these are looking like. So, let's see, treasure chests. Again, they're nice wood treasure chests. So, we've got several of those, which I think are kind of nice. And let's finally take a look at the cards. Again, all of their decks of cards are come in this nice themed box, which I think is really nice to protect them. And uh, I'm a big fan of protecting these, especially with storage, things like that. So um, it's really uh, a nice touch on their part. So let's see here. So we've got standard vote cards. We've got loyalty cards, uh, standard Tortuga cards, and then all player cards. So they have different things on here. So you have different actual pirates. <clears throat> including Henry Morgan. Looks like the treasure maps of Atlantis and El Dorado. Uh, different types of weaponry. Ooh, the black spot. That's kind of neat. So it's got some very nice theming into this game. 
Uh, ooh, Spanish Armada shows up. Black Powder, Scurvy. The French. That's kind of neat. So it's got some very interesting looking cards to it. I, I especially like the art that's on here. I think it's very well done. And again, these cards are nice quality. They have that kind of fabric feel to them, a little bit of waxiness to it. So nice quality cards. So, uh, so far I've liked all of the products that they've put out. Again, they put some effort into the uh, materials, which I think is a nice touch. And again, I'm a big fan of the nice uh, storage boxes that they've got in here. And I uh, think that uh, Tortuga 1667 is a very nice touch. And again, it has that nice magnetic close, just like the rest of their books. So I think it's a very well-designed game, very well-built. Um, and it has some very nice art and coloring to it. So again, this is Tortuga 1667.